the Greenlee EK50 ML, or other, otherwise known as the Micro. Uh, I want to tell a little bit of a story about this tool. Uh, Specifically, in about 2012, 2013, this tool was developed to work on a variety of crimping applications. So small gauge crimping applications that use terminals uh, or smaller applications uh, that you'd be uh, putting together for electrical assemblies. So this tool uh, was developed in mind with a variety of these different small types of terminal crimping dies uh, over the course of the uh, last few years, uh, we've also seen that this tool has a lot of application for cutting uh, that we've seen in the market as well. So kind of a unique tool. Uh, it's almost like as if it's a hybrid. Um, it has this manual application uh, that you can see that pulling the trigger and uh, moving the jaws to hold the uh, connector and then ultimately apply that to the conductor. So push down a little bit harder and then you also get that mechanical advantage that is built from this 10.8 uh, volt battery uh, that's being used. So what we wanted to do is we wanted to take that application that's historically known as a crimping application and we wanted to utilize it from a cutting application. So the reason why we wanted to do that is that we know that there's a lot of applications that involve a lot of repetitive motion uh, for soft uh, and hard metals. So specifically when people are using um, this tool or ultimately using some of the manually oriented tools in the marketplace. They'd be using a soft metal cutter like this or a hard metal cutter uh, as you would find in this side cutter on alignment players. So lower cost alternative, no question about it, but there's certainly a threshold uh, for how much, uh, how much grip strength you can create and then ultimately how many foot pounds these tools can create to get through a variety of different materials, whether it's aluminum or copper or whether it's steel. So the way that we look at it is um, you know, a really strong person, say a rock climber, which would be very, very strong uh, in their forearms. They can create about 200 pounds of grip strength. That grip strength is applied at various points along the handles of this tool. And then ultimately from a mechanical advantage, you can achieve about 700 pound, or 750 foot pounds of force uh, that can go through any given material. So just as in this situation, Going through number one, aluminum, which isn't too tough, but if you do that 50 times a day, it's gonna to start to wear on you. So, what we wanted to do is eliminate that 200 pounds of grip strength and apply it to something where you need six pounds of trigger strength uh, to cut through materials. So, what we wanted to do here is just kind of give a demo of how this tool works and how simple it is to actually work with. Just to show a little bit of that benefit uh, from the Micro, the EK50ML with the cutting jaw application that we have now, um, I'm going to go through some very, very simple materials, but I'm going to do it a couple times, and we'll see how easily this thing chews through aluminum. So as you can see, it makes very short time of that aluminum application. But now let's work with a little bit tougher material. So small gauge hard metal like this, number two ACSR. The EK50ML crimping and cutting tool from Greenlee.